I will relish that. Meanwhile, I refuse to squander valuable research opportunities. Do you have the next campaign mission? Therefore, you shall be my assistant. Go. All this is there a is campaign time. mission on your screen? Hold tab. Check the map. The purchase will suffice. Oh yeah, you get a free exotic too from that guy. Yes, we are done. Yeah. See Yo. if there's a campaign mission. All right, let's do that. The fuck y'all doing? Uh, we're. Javier put cake on my nuts. Oh, guy. Guys, you can't talk like that around me. I'm sorry, I'm Christian now. It's <laughs> very offensive. Man, what happened in a matter of a couple hours, dude? The internet went down, now you're Christian? What the fuck is this? Christian, I've got a wife, I've got... I've even got the pick offense now, Sheridan. <clears throat> Church Kev every Sunday. Kevin got a sex change? <laughs> no, y'all... He just looks good enough in a dress as is. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm, I'm messaging him right now. <laughs> what's your, uh, what's your YouTube what? handle? <clears throat> what's your YouTube name? Vegas OG? You should uh, join us. Unless you're doing something specific, well, I'm helping Kevin uh, level his Titan. <coughs> well, you should add him to the call. I'm asking him right now if you want to join. Yeah, might as well. Or I'll add him. Let's capture this lander. Actually, I can't. Wait, can I? Yeah, I, I can. Get, away. Get it out of here. Oh, protect me, some pipe. Tapped out. I'm good. I'm good. No, I'm not. <laughs> Look. There, like almost damn near full health. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Why is this, why is my ammo coming back? My ammo is just refilling automatically. I think it's good, I'm out of full super. When the arc conductor is active, shots fired have a chance to become chain lightning and return ammo. Oh. Okay. I like this gun. Oh god, that dude just fucking exploded on me. Did. 
God damn, what is hitting me so hard? This is actually kind of hard with just two of us. Oh, the ship's back, by the way. What the fuck is hitting Shoot that thing with rockets? I have to switch my fucking weapons up. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, oh, owie. I have a bunch of legendaries that I can put on. There we go. Sidearm. Sniper rifle. Oh, yeah. yeah. Fucking this guy up now. I'm shooting him in the head. I'm doing, I'm doing crits on the head. The, are you? Are you the crawl? <clears throat> oh, well either way, I'm pretty sure that both of them are crits. You can do either or. Oh, we did the heroic. We did it. Pretty decent for just two of us. What did Kevin say? He said he didn't want to join us because we're all gay. No, because he's not playing with us, so. And we hijacked the lander. That is adequately impressive. You have exceeded my expectations. Uh, how would Gucci Mane say it? Yeah, he would say it just like that. What are you, are you sure he wouldn't just say that as Gucci? If Edwin, uh, Master G one of one these days and was just like, hey, let's chill. Like chill online or chill IRL? Uh both. <laughs> both? I'd be like, well, kinda turned into a hermit crab, so I'm gonna take a rain <laughs> check on that one, but maybe we can play something online. Alright, so you'd be Plus down. It'd to be like... weird for him to be like, yeah, let's meet up. Totally not gonna fucking stab you or anything. Three years when I'm talking to him or some shit. I thought it's only been like two years. Yeah, maybe. So oh, I don't know. <laughs> Cody said that it's been like three years since I talked to him, but I don't think that's he true. He really trusts his judgment. <laughs> oh, I'll lift you. You gotta put some cake on much long though. God damn, you guys are suddenly gay. And I'm the one. I'm the one who was apparently changed. Oh, you phased out. Why does it do that? It's so annoying. No, you phased out. Oh yeah, there's certain spots where you where you're uh, you'll load. And 
you won't be able to see other characters in that zone until you enter the zone. So yeah, actually, Sheridan's right on that one. Sorry, Javier. Or maybe you're just so wrong all the time that you are desperately grasping for something to be right about. As we all know, Zavala plans right, well, to attack We're gonna have to go to the Pokemart and buy you a burn heal for that one. I'm sure he thought, ah, Gaul has a Sun Destroyer. I don't need a plan. I'll simply headbutt it. Well, I mean, she she is not right about everything, so. Zavala has forgotten she died. What the fuck? Oh, right, I forgot to do that. The energy mining operation, <coughs> we should be getting her mount pretty soon. Part of an interplanetary defense what level is he? 17. Oh yeah, then he's only got three more levels to go. So are the taken if that. Next too. Yeah, you get it at level 20. You and I, can I got mine at like 18 or 19. Really? Like legit. Yeah. This pistol is popping. Looks like a USP. Are you fucking kidding me? Pistol popping mama. Bro, I had a sugar crash earlier. Yeah. Well, I guess it's I guess I've, it's because it's been a while since I've had anything super sugary too, and I ate, I had I ate, had a whole large blizzard found and I ate it group. within like ten minutes. This one's big. Yeah, that really might be a problem. Good. That drill pierced an entrance to the war mine vault. So I like the scanners inside. I got hyped up for like a good 15, 20 minutes and then I was like, oh god, I'm feeling sleepy. It took a like three hour nap. Now we are here. Does it have a start of life? Shoot their uh, abdomen with a light long guard. <laughs> Throw some cake on that sheet. What is it with you and cake today, Sharon? We've got the power going, but the drill is still in our way. Do I feel like I missed something? What a gloriously That I feel no. I missed becoming out of the closet party? There has no. to be a manual override. Are both of you? Wait, what did we. Why can't we scan this, dude? Throw some cake on it. Oh, you already did. Don't, don't, don't. Just don't. Just don't. Just don't. I find it incredible that those what? Red Legion ignorami did not realize they were drilling directly into a war mine. Is a cake a euphemism for something, or are you both just super into fucking sweets today? But they're left. <laughs> we'll need to override them. Stranger things happen every day. Okay. You got free food at your dad's house. What'd you get, by the way? Sterile neutrino particles have quintupled. He means watch out. Roberto's. You should hire a translator, Asher. Oh, well, I mean, he's okay? Mexican, so. Yeah. By the way that you guys are talking about cake, I don't think I want to hear that Javier's dad gave him cake. So. It's not sexual. I mean, it doesn't like, make it any better. <laughs> okay. No, there's a guy. There was a guy that was talking to our squad. He was like, "What's up?" And I'm just, and I say it in the chat. Cake on my nuts. <laughs> and the other guy started laughing too. The guy, the guy whose name is Cake on my nuts. And then I proceeded to get claps. We all died. Oh, that's how it goes. Oh, I've been sucking at RRB so hard lately. I've not been able to get any kills. Even I'm not doing as great as I used to. Like, like earlier when. Why? Okay, you go to hand with the hand guider. You did the same thing last game. Oh. <laughs> the first one that you're the first one that died. Yo, but up here you said yourself. Usually when I do like aggressive plays with the hand glider, it usually pays off. It almost always pays off. 
It's just recently as a whole, I just haven't been doing good. Even in PvP on this game. You got the hang glider and Destiny. Well, no, I mean, like, in general, like, when playing this game, I haven't been doing as good as I usually do. Nice Whoa, look at this, Javier. Fucking... Can okay, you guys... Right now you're going too far, dude. We're gonna have to call the game police on you. Yeah, I'm not a fan of chocolate cake, Javier, I'm sorry. To the drill site and get into the war, my fault. So, what happened with your internet? <laughs> um, I'm not sure. <laughs> A master. Fuck you up. Fuck you up. Fuck you up. So Javier, have you watched a show called uh, Charlie Park Boys? It's funny as hell. You should watch it on Netflix. It's a show about Canadians literally in a, in a trailer park smoking bud and drinking liquor. So, what's a war mine? Yeah. Exactly. You don't want to go visit Canada again. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've been to Canada. Same, I might see Max. <coughs> oh, I freaking forgot that Max lives in Canada. Whoa, He's friends with that uh, <coughs> Jade Dragon <coughs> gaming guy that I showed you. Speaking of which, was the, when was the last time you talked to Max? Uh, It's probably been about the same time as he said. When I got the Edwin, so it's probably been like two, three years. Do you remember Ash? Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I heard that he, uh, he, he he was like friends with me and Tyler, wasn't he? That was like yeah. back in that era. Well, no, he he was someone that I think we met on. I think he may have been Fudge's friend. I don't remember. I remember he was brand new uh, to League when we started playing. He was a rando. And, I thought. Yeah, maybe. I don't remember. But I think he actually I think he actually like stuck with League and got to platinum one season. No, he didn't. No, he got <laughs> fucking high in rank or well not super high, but high for what we thought he'd be able to achieve. I remember he at least got like high gold, if I'm not mistaken. They yeah, might have got Gold. I don't think his ass got flat. Is it gold flat? And diamond? Is that the, or am I fucking things up? What? In ranked. You said three different ranks. It, well, yeah. I, when I said those three ranks, I meant is that the order. It goes from gold to flat to diamond? Yeah. Okay. I don't remember. I remember he got fucking high. He got a lot higher than I thought he ever would. Because I remember fucking... Well, you know that the guy I told you, the guy I showed you about on YouTube, he's literally like bronze too. I want to one v one him and see if I lose against that. I just need honestly. Should watch him. Can you tell me? We should really watch that YouTube video. Whatever you want. I don't know if I can, man. I don't know if I'm physically. Oh, you should. You really should. Ignore Asher. It's funny. Find the war. I added him on. I've added him on the one of my olds. And I'm like, hey, I, I was I've been watching your YouTube video videos the last couple of days. I figured I'd treat your request. And he's like, oh, hey, thanks. It's always nice to meet new people. I know my con my content can be kind of cringy. <laughs> That's legit what he said. Hey, at least he admits it, dude. That's listen. Step one to recovery is to always admit you have a problem. <laughs> I mean, apparently he has a wife. So I mean, I'm not gonna talk shit, but if if he can find a, a wife who Everyone can't. Oh, just Joe. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> what? What are you saying, Javier? Oh, oh yeah, William doesn't need a waifu. He got a, he's got a husbando. He's got two husbandos. I'm telling you, this pistol clappity clap. You know what the special move is on this shit? 
kick on my nuts. Maybe I like both. Listen, having cakes sprinkled with nuts is good, okay? I was about to say, uh, that yes. doesn't sound like, too bad. Con? Cons are fucking delicious. What, what are those, like, ice cream bars that have, uh, nuts on them and then they have chocolate at the bottom of the handle? Snowballs or whatever? Not snowballs. Oh, yeah. I said... <coughs> they're, um... Fuck. I can't remember. You know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah, like a lot of um It's like a traditional ice cream cone too with breading and then like chocolate at the bottom. Breading. Not breading, not breading, but like cone. Basic cone. Yeah. It comes in like a blue box usually, right? The main yeah. brand. Yeah. I don't... No, it's not blue bunny, man. It's not blue bunny, okay. God. Get that shit out of here. Yeah, but that's not what we're talking about. We're not talking about that shit. Terrible out here. Bad for your health out okay. here. I I used to work in the I used to I used to work in the frozen section in Walmart. And we, I had this guy. I, I ran out of primary ammo. I sniped him. I sniped him in the head as soon as he died. Oh God! No respond. Responding. You had what? You had a guy at Walmart when you worked in the freezer. I had this this kid named Sean. He was very very timid, very like super timid. But he was like hella cool. But we would <laughs> work in the frozen section, and he was so. I remember I used to be. I was like friends to him, but I'd fuck around with him at the same time. And like, uh, <laughs> sure, you never you're never supposed to work that kind. Of, uh, like mix that and work together, Sheridan. I I always told him not to like be careful not to claim shit out and I swear every time I told him that he claimed more stuff out. <laughs> like he would always purposely it's like he purposely break ice cream shit open. <laughs> like Sean, you literally claims five boxes of ice cream today. You know what we're gonna have to do, right? We're gonna have to use some of this ice cream. <laughs> Dude, so we're like, um, in, we're like in the back of the freezer eating it, because <laughs> we put it in a fucking bin and we just to throw it away anyways. Sacrifice. Oh, your Walmart sacrifice. didn't donate that shit? I know they do, but like, yes. how are they supposed to know if they've like one or two ice cream bars? Feel free to kill yourself. Uh, actually, my manager told me to um, claim shit out when um, we got produce shipments. She was like, get like one box of strawberries, one box of pineapple, and one box of grapes, and claim it out, and then you can eat it. Wow. We can never do it with, like, ice cream and shit, but when it came to, like, the produce and shit, we were allowed yeah, to do Yeah, because ice cream is more expensive. Uh, produce is, like, cheap in, in small quantities. Well, yeah, and the reasoning of it was just like, okay, well, you need people need to check to see if this is any good. So it's like opening it up to inspect it, we're gonna have to claim it out anyway. So you might as well eat it, and if it's disgusting, then we need to send it back to the fucking provider. Makes sense. But you know what? Oh, you know what the absolute fucking worst is, Sheridan? Fucking, fucking frozen in the middle of the day. It's fucking terrible. Why? Oh, because all the like volume of people. Yeah, it's not like at night when you can just like lie in the aisles full of shit, because the whole twenty the um, twenty minutes uh, roll or whatever. Yeah, frozen stuff or refrigerated stuff can't be out for more than twenty minutes. Like, yeah, we kind of didn't night, really follow that because we had like a it, giant pallet of frozen. <laughs> Yeah, well, yeah, at night, like, it was fine, usually, but, like, at the middle of the day, when a district manager might come by, it's just like, hey, how long have you been out here on the floor with the, that pallet of uh, frozen ice cream that is now all over the floor because it's melted? You can't just say, oh, I just got here. But, yeah, during the day, you actually have to, like, follow the fucking rules and watch it, and it is terrible. It is actually terrible. It's so stupid, too, because they have, like, so much ice cream. Like, how the fuck do you expect to, like... Get all that shit out and 
Four, right? And I remember ten, going to work one day, four, and Amy, nine, who always told me, it's like, you have to make sure that you never have a cart with more this stuff than you can put away in 20 minutes. It's like, okay, A, if I grab a cart that I can put away in 20 minutes, it's going to have, like, 10 cases on it. The only way. Legit, in the middle of the day, it's going to have, like, 10 cases in it. But I, one day I come in, and here she is with three pallets in the fucking aisle at, like, 7 in the morning, or, like, 10 in the morning. I'm just like... You can put away all of this in 20 minutes. That's pretty much managers in a nutshell. Wait, he what? For what? I mean, it's not it's not bad. Like, if once you get into a groove of, of doing Frozen, it's not hard. Oh, Frozen? I mean, you have to kind of hustle, but I mean, like, the only thing I'd be worried about is your knee, like moving and moving shit around all the time, and constantly having to squat down and uh, get down and need to uh, like fill the bottom shelf. If you can get into dairy, though, that would be. If you can get into dairy, specifically milk, if you have like an actual store where you stock the milk from the back, that shit is so easy. It's, like, like if you can get into that, that would that is the sweet job right there because you always <sighs> need to have milk out and just stock the shit from the back. And then if you have a good store, you have roller, you have all of your carts um, pushed up against the door, or you, um, all the trays or whatever, um, and they're on wheels, so you can just like pull that shit out and just like power wash it, and then. And then everything's just clean. Unfortunately, it wasn't like that at my Walmart. I had to fucking get uh, U-boats and load that sh load milk up on fucking U-boats. Yeah, because... Yeah, ours wasn't that like that. Our The Walmart I worked at um, wasn't actually supposed to be a grocery store. It was originally just a normal Walmart that sold a couple like dry goods, but mostly like clothing and electronics and sporting and shit. Uh, Target upgraded their uh, facility, so we had to do the same because we were losing a lot of business, and yeah, our milk was all the way at the front of the store, so there was no way um, you had to just load up a U-boat full of fucking milk, and one day, one of our um, one of our mite stalkers obeyed. He transferred to Dave, and this motherfucker could put he would do double what every other night stalker would fucking do. Like, he was always hustling. Like, during the day, we didn't need to do shit because he'd, uh, he would do everything. But the problem is that he would never, um, he would never look at dates properly. So there'd be, so every day I got into work, I'd always have to go double check his work to make sure he actually pulled all the expired shit out. And he it was always missing shit. There was stuff I had to pull off every day, which was fine because of the amount of work he was already doing. I didn't mind. But there was one day he gave you something to do, too. Yeah. There was one day he fucking, in the middle of the afternoon, luckily it was in the back room, but he loaded up a U-boat with like twice as much milk as anyone else would normally do, and he comes flying out of the fucking cooler around the corner, and half of it just flips on its side. <laughs> it busted open 13 <laughs> gallons of fucking milk, dude. You know I've seen that shit happen. Do you know how annoying it is to clean up 13 gallons of milk? Okay. <coughs> yeah, I've seen a lot of pallets tilt over. It's, it's hilarious to watch every time. It sucks when it's a fucking.